trap. It, it was a trap. They knew we were coming. The Supernal Dreamers. Master Muzgu said they were up to no good, and he was right. He and Brother Gerard are fighting them off. I, I ran to get help. Can you save them? I should have fought harder. I should have protected Master Muzgu. It's the Supernal Dreamers. They've opened a portal to Oblivion in Maw Cave. That's where those scamps came from. And we came here to close it. It was a trap. The Dreamers wanted Master Muzgu for some reason. And now they've got him. They're trying to open more portals here and there. We need to stop that. But I have to go try to save Master Muzgu. Can you kill some scamps and hurl their heads into the nascent portals? The magical feedback should shut them down. I'm a spirit warden from Pariah Abbey, just west of here. We protect Stormhaven from unseen threats. Nasty things from Vermina's realm of nightmare. We act in Azura's name. They're badly misguided people who worship Vermina, the Daedric Prince of Nightmares. And that's what the Master says. I don't think they're misguided. I think they're rotten. And I'm going to kill the ones who took Muzgu. It's simple transliminal metaphysics. The scamps just came here through another portal from Quagmire, Vermina's realm, so they're still charged with positive creation. Got that? They're badly misguided people who work.
the Zora. This is bad. While I was fighting my way in, the cultists performed a ritual on Musku. He's partially possessed by a Daedric spirit. He's stuck in a terrible dilemma. He insists I should return alone to Pariah Abbey, but I can't just leave him. Please, talk to him. He's mad if he thinks I'll leave here without him. There's something he's not telling me. To Quagmire, realm of the Daedric Prince Vermina, Queen of Nightmares. Believe me, she means the mortals of this plane nothing but ill. He clawed at me. Bless you. But neither of you needed to risk your lives for me. What I need is strength of will. I need you to kill me. The Supernal Dreamers performed a ritual. They summoned the Daedric spirit and bound it within me. My brother Durok taught me to contain the spirit temporarily, but it's gaining strength. I can't hold out much longer. I'm a powerful spirit warden. If the Daedric spirit possesses me, it will combine my power with its own. I would become a danger to everyone in Stormhaven. You need to kill me before that happens. No. If I leave this gate to Quagmire, the spirit will take me. Unless... I suppose I could force the spirit out of me and into a dreaming cultist. It's not as certain, but it could work. Very well. I'll contain the Daedra as long as I can. Take a scroll of dream trapping from the rock over there, and use it on a sleeping cultist to bind him to your will. Then you can lead him back here. What's going on? Where are you taking me? I don't understand. I was... I was... Everything is ready. But I must be certain. When I expel this Daedra, it will be drawn into the cultist. And he will die. Are you sure you're willing to sacrifice this man? Very well. This cultist will take my place and be infused with the Daedric spirit. We'll expel the Daedra, draw the cultist into ritual circle. After the Daedric spirit consumes its victim, it will return to Quagmire. Follow the spirit through the portal to Quagmire, kill the Daedra there, then return. Ready? What?
Praise Azura. You survived. The Daedra is no more. I owe my life to you. You'll still have to fight your way out. But once I'm confident no trace of the Daedra remains, Gerard and I will disperse the cultists and return to Pariah Abbey. It's a... Praise Azura. We're desperate, I beg you. The Abbey's under attack. They're trying to burn the place down. Bandits. They look like they're with the Midnight Union, but there's no time to explain. Just please go to the northwest entrance and talk to Sister Sophia. She'll tell you how you can help. it to tend to. Please, you have to help me. The Midnight Union bandits. I don't know why. I was no threat to them. But they attacked me anyways. No, no. I am a healer. I can take care of myself. It's the others. So many of my fellow wardens are injured. I was trying to help them, but I... I can't really go on. Take these poultices. It should at least help them get on their feet so they can get to safety. I 
don't understand how this could be happening. We have no feud with it. Certainly. The bandits set everything on fire. The whole place is going up in smoke, and they're preventing us from putting the fires out. We weren't prepared to fight. Take this bucket. I appreciate your smugglers mostly. You will always be welcome at the Abbey. May Azura bless you for all your days. You will always be welcome at the Abbey. May Azura bless you for all your days. I can see that many of the small fires have been extinguished. Thank you for volunteering to help us. Thanks for pitching in. I think we've saved enough crops to make it through the winter. But why did this happen? What's it all about? I hesitate to ask you for further assistance, but if you're willing, your help would certainly be appreciated. Our leader, Abbot Durak, left some time ago and hasn't returned. I fear he may be injured or worse. Abbot Durak and a few others went to the Cave of Dreams on the North Ridge. Durak wanted to get something to help put out the fires. Brother Hakam went after them with a scroll of return to help get them back sooner. Now I worry about Hakam too. Both. But look for Brother Hakam first. With the scroll of return, you can get Abbot Durak back here sooner, where I hope he'll be able to put out that big fire. I saw many of my fellow wardens make it to safety. Thank you. It's so ironic that we rely on a stranger's help after being attacked by those we considered friends. Thank you for asking. I'm feeling better already. It's certainly a relief to know that the other wardens are safe. I'll be able to get back to the Abbey soon. Perhaps I'll see you there.
Friend or foe, declare yourself. No one will harm the abbot. Not while I draw breath. And I have more terrible news. Those damned outlaws cast a sleeping spell on Abbot Durok. I can't wake him. He came down here for this scroll of summoning, said it would stop the biggest fire. I just hope it's worth what it cost. As Jura prays his foresight, this will get us back to the Abbey. Durok said this scroll of summoning should be read near the largest fire in the field. Please, take it and use it there. I'll meet you at the Abbey when you're done. Atronach. Simply amazing. Durok, you were right, my friend. You were right. He's still under a sleep spell. But I've learned something. The Midnight Union wanted us to panic. The attack, the fires, they were just a diversion. While we were distracted, they entered the Abbey and stole the Dream Shard. You must awaken Abbot Durok. He'll know how to get the Dream Shard back. Talk to our healer, Frizzweir. He's inside, tending to the abbot. We can't create more dreamless potions without the dream shard. Without those potions, we, and the king, are vulnerable to the supernal dreamers. The dream shard is a priceless relic, a literal piece of Azura's realm of moon shadow. With it, we can distill water from the cave of dreams into dreamless potions. Without that shard, we can't make any more of them. We use them to protect ourselves from nightmare attacks by our enemies, the Supernal Dreamers. Since we don't dream, we're not vulnerable to dream magic. We also send them to the King and his counselors. Another reason we're tolerated here. Exactly. So you see how important it is to recover the Dream Shard. The safety of the realm is at stake. Did you hear that someone actually escaped from the lab? Say, I heard you recently arrived from Alcare. There are terrible rumors about Duchess Lacana. Are they true? Was she murdered? I am sorry to hear about the Duchess. She was a good woman. The omen of fear, you say? I recollect hearing something about such Daedra before. You should ask Abbot Durak. He would know. You're the one who helped save our fields. Listen, I may have discovered the source of Durak's affliction. It won't be easy. The spell enthralling the Abbot traps him in sleep and forces him to dream. It's a clever spell, since the spirit wardens can't enter his dream. In fact, we can't dream at all. We drink dreamless potions nightly. 
That's why we're immune to dream attacks from our enemies, the Supernal Dreamers. As of now, you're the only person in Pariah Abbey who can dream. The only one who can save Durok. We have another potion we rarely use, a Dream Stride potion. It'll put you into a dreaming sleep. Then I can merge your mind with Abbot Durok's. You must find him in his dream, figure out what holds him there, and awaken him. have betrayed us. The Midnight Union are now enemies, and I failed to see it coming. I can't, my child. These chains bind me to my nightmare. However, it's still my dream. So I know one of the Midnight Union men outside carries the key to my chains. Slay them until you find it. Don't hesitate or fear. They're only dream spirits. In this dream state, only you and I are real. And I'm only really certain of myself. Find the key? Good. Once I've removed these chains, we'll awaken. Speak with me again in the waking world. Without you, I'd still be trapped in that dream. Now we must work together to stop this threat to Stormhaven. You saw my dream. Clearly, Vermina's cult, the Supernal Dreamers, is behind this betrayal by the Midnight Union. The outlaws of the Union took the Dream Shard, but I fear it's for Vermina's evil purposes. We must recover it. I don't look forward to informing the King about this, but we must let him know as soon as possible. He will not be pleased. King Emmerich must be informed that without the Dream Shard, we won't be able to supply him the dreamless potions that protect him from the Supernal Dreamers. His Majesty might reward the one who brings him word of this. Would you do it? Seek out the King in Wayrest and give him the news. He must know as soon as possible. Then you need to find the Midnight Union. True. But not yet. The entire purpose of the attack on the Abbey was to acquire the Dream Shard, and its purpose is as a defense against the Supernal Dreamers. I do, which means those cultists are planning something, something big. King Emmerich must be warned. That is the highest priority.
the dreg attack again, we're all dead. 